Hey, this is Kyle Rotter. Welcome to Extreme Rules. This is going to be one of the wildest matches that I wanted in the last time. Mm -hmm. But, of course, as a general manager, I had to pull some strings. And I got Crash Helios Yellow versus Vincent Kennedy. We're going to see once and for all if Vince, his catchphrase, I'll never die, holds up. Because it's Vince versus Crash in an asylum match for the Hardcore Championship. And you all might be like, what's the asylum match? Well, it's basically a steel cage match, but the steel cage looks a little different. And it's like rusty, and it looks like a. All right, I just want to. I just want to see Crash do his little dance out. Let's get to it. All right, let's, let's go. go. All right, here we go. Let me unmute the TV. All right, come on, Crash. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Steel cage. It's the asylum match. There he is. Let's see. What if again Goldust interferes? If Goldust comes out again, then I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to find another one of my biggest champions to come out. <laughs> I don't think you got any bigger than Andre. But and Andre Rikishi, I think you got Rikishi. I'll stink face him. It might be all three of them. Let's turn it up a bit, shall we? You just never know what's gonna happen. All right, here we go. Crash. Truth says at the top. Crash is the truth. Here he comes. There he is with that hardcore championship. Hardcore champion Crash Yellow. All right, let's get this match started. The Asylum. Let's look at the cage come down. Or not, not yet. What do you think, our midgets in the audience again? I don't know. If he's a true fan, he will. I don't know if he's got front row seats, so. though. He's from Connecticut. Yes. <laughs> I wish you said Vincent Kennedy McMahon. It's that double M. <laughs> mm -hmm. There he is, the man. Not Vince. <laughs> the man, Crash. Oh, I, I see the midget. Where's the midget? Oh, there he is. He is definitely, he is definitely the man. Or definitely the almost the man. We might have to give him a contract. <laughs> the midget. All right, let's get this asylum going. There it is. The asylum. Here we go. Come on, Crash. Let's see what you got. All right, predictions. Crash Helios Yellow. All right, we're both going for Crash. Oh, my goodness. This cra Crash isn't wearing any pants. Man, what happened to his pants? He's not wearing pants. Oh, my God. Yeah, the shorts are gone. What's up with that? This is old school Crash. Old school Crash. No pants. My goodness, Crash is just demolishing Mr. McMahon. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's right to the eyes. He's got to play cheap, but look at the, uh, Crash is just too Crash too is showing agile. all the bills. <laughs> he's a true champion. Oh, my goodness. He's going to break his leg. Don't break his hip. <laughs> it takes a while to heal when you're 73 from a broken hip. Yeah. Ooh. Look See, look, we got a different referee now than the first mm -hmm. one that let Goldust do the move to Mr. McMahon. Yeah, I said I wasn't allowing him that back there. I don't want that referee. All right, crash. Uh-oh. Vince trying to sneak it. On well, count of one, I heard the ref count. Mm -hmm. Very quiet, but he said it. It is a fast match for the 73 year old. Oh, what's this? Okay. I will say though, Vince is in much better shape than his son. 
Uh oh. He's going. That's his signature. Mm. That's the, is he going to go for global warming next? Or is he going for a pin? He's going for a pin. I'm going to crash. One, two. Oh, he oh. kicked out. Thank you, Sugo, for global warming. Or not. <laughs> Jeez, another cutter. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Global warming. Oh, oh, the fence rolls out of the way. The stars weren't uh -oh. aligned. Uh-oh, here we go. Pedigree. Pedigree. Oh, man. That could be it. Uh-oh. What is he doing? He's going for another one. That might not be a good idea. It wasn't a good idea. Oh, oh my goodness, a power bomb. The Vince. Jeez. I'm going to crash. Don't Vince, waste too much time. Vince shouldn't have went after that second pedigree. He should have just went for the pin. He could have won. But he goes crash again with a neck breaker. Now he's telling Vince to get up. For a minute there, Vince thought this was 1973. <laughs> Instead of being 73. Uh oh. Oh my goodness, Crash is just. Crash is on fire today. Uh huh. Oh, but Vince. I think it's because he didn't wear his shorts. Oh, here you go. One, two, he kicked out. And yeah, maybe the shorts is, makes him slow down. I don't know. Alright, he's got Vince in the corner. What is he going for here? My goodness! Now what is he doing? Crash. Is he going for global warming once again? Is he going to connect global oh. warming? I think that's it. That might be it for Vince. Here Come we on. go. One, two, three. Yes, crash, here crash, in quick fashion. This is has great. beaten Vince McMahon. Crash Look absolutely dominated that match. Crash was definitely That on. is... That was definitely a crash. <laughs> crash into Vince. I mean... Vince only got... If I think if Vince would have went for that pin inside of the second pedigree, he might have won. He might be... That, after that, he should have won for the pin. He shouldn't have won for another one. And look at that neck breaker. Jeez. It wasn't looking good for Crash when he missed the first global warming. Yeah, I didn't. I don't know. The sun and the clouds just weren't lined up for him right then. Mm -hmm. Look he at him. Is. He's so excited. He is happy. Okay, I'm so happy. You can't see the expressions, but. Believe me, he's happy. Wow. Well, it's time for the next match. It's Seamus's and Goldust punishment. This is going to be the punishment of all punishments. All right, here we go. The punishment match. This is what happens, Goldust, when you mess with me. <laughs> and Seamus. And Seamus. Don't forget him. Right, Look at this is. boy. This ain't a boy, this is a man. monster. That's a man. Look at that monster. Looks like he's got ear muffs on his face. <laughs> what is that? Oh, no, don't come after me, Andre. I was just joking. I should have said it in another language. Oh, wait. Isn't his language French? Uh-huh. So he didn't understand me anyway. Bonjour. <laughs> That's all I know. Come see, come saw. Come a right. And his partner. Here he is. And I got one more if they want to keep messing with us. <laughs> Sporting Andre's attire. Look at him. He's coming in with a purpose. Uh -huh. He's like, look at that face. He's like, this is <laughs> nothing for me. Yeah. Like, I'm not worried a bit. Uh-uh. It, I don't think this is going to be very long. Most people talk about Dream Match of Big Show versus Andre. But what about Dream Match of them teaming together? Oh, yeah. They're unstoppable. Uh-huh. I think they may be calling 1-800-GOLD after this. 
uh -huh. cash in the gold dust for some money. <laughs> You might not be worth anything after this punishment. Yeah, I don't know. Because they're wearing the same singlet. Yep. Alright, here comes the ginger, the white man. Yeah, he's going to be a white man, Art. He's going to be a cloud. <laughs> Him and the dust is going to... When the dust settles... I'm hoping it's not an upset here. I, you just never know what could happen. I don't know what will happen. This is extreme rules. What? You just never know. Tell us, what do you? What will you do if they, if Seamus and Gold Rush win? Well, I don't have much more in my arsenal, but um, I predict that Rikishi's going to come in there and he's going to eat a lot of beans. All right. So, so you're out. saying if Seamus and Gold Dust win, it would be Seamus versus Rikishi for the title? Well, or will it be a three on two, a three on one? I haven't decided yet, but um, right. it depends on how, what kind of shape they're in. Uh huh. Now, what if Big Show and Andre are the win? Now, if Big Show and Andre win, then I think if they win, they both get a shot at the table. Yeah, they deserve it. I say if they win on the next pay-per-view or episode of Raw, you can save for money in the bank or whatever you want. You're the general manager. I think it should be a triple threat. Sheamus, Andre, and Big Show. Well, but you know, you're the general I gotta, manager. I gotta so. wait and see how um, Big yes. Show and Andre perform for me here. Yes. I've got them built up pretty high and I don't see my midget in the audience. Oh, he's somewhere. He's behind the announcer's table. Well, I got gold dust. I got them pretty high up on there. And now they got high expectations, so they better deliver. Uh huh. But this, this is, is not predetermined, so you. This is an know. extreme rules match, by the way. All right, it looks there like they're doing go. good. Uh -oh. Just don't wear out too fast, there, guys. Oh. Look how massive Andre is compared he is a, to. He is a oh, look at Goldust rubbing his stuff. What a freak! Yeah, Goldust is a freak. Jeez, he just bit Andre. He shoved him away. Look at Seamus trying to just tap out Big Show. There you go. Oh, there Jeez. you go. Oh, well, I want to see Andre get a little bit of that Seamus. There there oh. Oh. oh, Big Show! Big, Big Show, Show ain't really—he's not performing so well. No, he must have had a lot of carbs before the match. Uh huh. Carbs slow you down. I don't know how many plates? To be honest, have. I thought the match would be over by now. I did too. I thought. No, oh, what? Oh, oh, this giant having trouble with a short. I don't know. He's picking at us up now. Mm -hmm. They're the only ones up now. Jeez, that knee, oh my. Seamus might have a broken jaw. Uh oh. Help him, Big Show. Yeah, Big Show, what are you doing? Get him in the corner, there you go, get him out of there. Big Show ain't helping at all. Oh, Goldust getting him from behind. Big Show ain't performing. Yeah, Big Show's very disappointing. If Big Show don't watch it, he's gonna go up against Andre. <laughs> I'm just staring at Seamus. Oh, this is what I have. Oh, he just throws him out. Uh oh, is he going out? Andre has a big problem. He don't like when people don't perform. Mm -hmm. Oh, so there's no telling what Andre will do to Big Show. Uh oh, Seamus. Oh, here he goes. Going under the ring. What's he got? He's got a chair. He can't do oh, nothing. Oh, to Andre. I, well, that's the only way you can well, defeat him, I guess. But Andre powers through it. There you go. Take that. Put him through the steel steps. <laughs> you really want somebody, I want those somebody steps. to go through them steps. I've heard a lot of people say the steps are fake. Let's see. Let's see how fake they are. Throw him through the steps. A big show's finally doing something, it looks like. 
Yep, there we go. One, two, three. That's it. Well, I don't know why um, Andre didn't give him an extra stomp. But, yeah. Look at that. Right. I know it's the meat one. Who would have thought that in the beginning, I wouldn't have thought that the Big Show would have been I the one to do the pin. Well, I mean, he did pin Gold Dust. Yeah, well, so, I a mean. Pin's a pin. Yeah. There you go. We might have a new tag team. Uh oh. There might be something in the works here. First ever giant and mini giant. <laughs> Who'd ever thought that Big Show would actually be the small? Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, you know what time it is? It's time for the main event. Ding, ding, ding. The match that nobody has known has been made yet. Well, I don't even know what it is. Yeah, you do. But let's get uh, into it right now. All right, here we come with the surprise match. The surprise of all surprises. I knew about it all along. Here comes Finn and... Wait, drum roll. Drum roll. There he is. There he is. The cash man. Set the cash man. Let me tell you something. I got my hundred dollar belt on the cash man. <laughs> All right. It's the cash man versus Finn Balor for the WWE Championship in a tables match. Let me tell you something. The cash man has been underestimated for a while now, but... I mean, I don't care what anybody says. The cash man might be a hundred hour guy, but he's a million dollar man for me tonight. He's so far, only one TWF star has gotten, well, I don't know how to explain it, but you know what I'm talking about, right? He's gotten into the spotlight. You. Crash Helios Yellow is the only TWF star to prove himself as a good wrestler. Now, Finn thinks that he can win on abs alone, but <laughs> abs can't go up against $100 bills. Uh -huh. $100 shoes, $100 belt. Well, let's see this match. All right, let's get it underway. Where's my guy in the audience? Has he got tickets for this? The midget? He should be in there. Where uh -huh. is he? I think he's in the same spot as he was. Yeah, I see him. I just saw him. As long as he's there. All he's right. a good luck charm for my company. There he is, Benny. And Finn. In a tables match. Here we go. Well, now this Benny, could be a long match or this could be a quick one. Now Benny, I need to see you put Finn through a table. You will earn the respect you've been waiting for. Hmm. For all the gingers out there. Oh, I see the midget. You see the guy, the yellow shirt up top? I'm looking for him. I saw the midget. I saw his bright hair. Oh, look at this. Well, there he is, the midget. Finn is really... Ugh. Not good for... This is not good for the cash, man. I see the midget uh -huh. on the side here. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yep. The midget. We're going to have to make sure he gets to every show. Every um, episode, he, he's the man. All right. The I might bring man. him up for a commentating one day. <laughs> you never know. You know, I think we should give the kid a chance, you know? Uh -huh. It looks like the cash man's got a fresh new haircut. Oh. Uh-huh. He must have hit the barber. The barber must have came over the house. Oh, yeah. All right. Come on, he's just trying to choke him out. Oh, kick, punch, no, reverse. I'm a cash man. It's unusual for Finn to look like a giant. <laughs> it is. Don't underestimate the cash man. I'm not underestimating him. But people underestimated us, and we lost. Well, that is true, but... You know. Oh, that looked like that hurt. As you see, Finn comes in here thinking that he's automatically going to win because he's got abs. Uh-huh. Well, you he what. is the WWE champion. Mm -hmm. He may be the champion. But, who knows? I mean, 
he does have that cool looking red attire on. He, he does look cool, I've got to give him, he's got a nice beard, I mean, he's got good style, but, so there's the cash man, look at the cash man with them kicks, and I don't mean the shoes, <laughs> I'm guessing you taught him those stomps, didn't you, oh my I goodness, did, that I, DDT, I taught him everything he don't know, <laughs> uh, -huh. uh oh, what's this? Oh, right to the shin. I'll tell you one thing. I know what his theme song should be. What's that? Oh, a code break. That's his signature, the code I breaker. Don't even, I don't even know if we can say it in here, but I'll I'll just say a little bit. It, it's got something to do with pumped up something. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We might get copyrighted, but that's yeah. his theme. Yeah. I think Benny's ready for the end. Yeah. Oh. Oh, but Finn might be too. I'm I, think Benny. I think he's trying to get the table. Benny's favoring that knee. Uh, Finn's trying to pick up the table. Finn, is you going to slam him onto the table? Mm. Oh! I don't know, he kind of missed. But he got it. He still hit him with Oh, man, this is not looking good for Benny. Uh, wait a minute. Uh-oh. We saw this in my match. Yeah. With the cruiserweights. Come on, Benny. Uh oh. Uh oh. You can do it. Oh, oh my goodness. Too bad if table wasn't there. But my goodness. Look at the little midget. The midget's so excited, but you can't see him. Because the little woman in his way. There he is. He's, he has to stand up. The midget's got to stand up All right, on his Benny. chair. Oh, the he's got man. the chair. He's got the table up. I mean, the table is out. This could, be it. Builds. this could be it. If he gets him in the ring. Come on, Cash Man. Got right my... into the ring. Here we go. I got my ATM card in and I got a hundred dollars uh -oh. pushed. Uh oh. Oh. Oh no. This doesn't look good. No. Come oh, on. here we go. Come on. He's breaking out. Benny, get him there. Come on. Uh-oh. No. Oh, God. Jeez. This is back and forth. Back and forth. <laughs> I almost choked. Uh, I wouldn't want to be against those ropes right on, now. Come on, Cash Man. Come on. You got this. Finn's just patiently waiting. Come on. Come uh -oh. on, Cash Man. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Jeez. I'm at oh, the Finn's edge of my seat. Up. He's taking... Uh, I know what he's doing. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, my this could goodness. This for the cash man. This is a different Finn here. Oh, he's standing in the corner. Finn's going This might it. be it. Come on. Oh, no. Oh. This could be it. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, no. no. Oh, he reversed it. <gasps> Come on, Benny, cash man. Benny. Oh. oh, no, he didn't go through. He didn't get through. I thought these were My breakaways. Goodness. That solid steel. Is that is he gonna do it? Come on. Come on, Cash. Man. Benny got it. You got Looks what like it he's, takes. Got, he's got oh, it. Yes! I knew he could the do new it. WWE champion. The Cash Man Benny. Don't ever underestimate My the goodness. Cash Man. That was Oh, he had me scared for a few there. I have been. I've been waiting to see a table. No, I thought he was going through there. Benny quickly slipped out of the way of that oh. power bomb. I thought Finn was going through this. Boom! That's your number one draft pick. That is Finn? definitely. As much as I like Finn, that I was really... your number one draft pick versus your number thirty. I'm always for the underdog. And I knew that the cash man needed his chance. Just like the Miz needed his chance. He got it. And look at the Miz. Now he is the head man. Look at that. You see a new you see a new cash man. Look, he's all cocky. He's walking through with a purpose. He ain't got his head down no more. Well, that look was some him. great extreme rules. Look at him. He's walking out of there proud. Wow. Well, 
I that, guess that pep talk I gave the cash man worked. That was a great show. That was one of the best ones here. We got a lot of good ones, but this was really good. Well, the next episode is going to be my show. All right? So, we'll see you then, because I have a special main event. All right, this is the very excited Kyle Ryder. I thought I was excited when Crash came out. <laughs> this was really good. I was very happy. We'll see you next time. Now I can die happy. <laughs>